What is up, my broskies? And this is a game with my new team. Um, if you were wondering, um, Ryan was in this game, Hardcore was in this game, and Venom was in this game, and of course me. I believe I go six and two, and I fast forward this first round because it was so long, and we do end up losing this first round. And we came back pretty good. Oh, and by the way, I'm sorry I didn't get a video up yesterday. I just was not feeling very good. And um, but we did do a bunch of GBs yesterday, so I do have some gameplay for y'all. On the bright side, although I, I didn't get a commentary yesterday, which is fine. Um, hopefully, you guys don't care too much. But yeah, this was this was a fairly competitive game. These guys weren't amazing, um, but we're not very good at these maps yet. So, like, we're just basically posting any match and taking anything. And we did get a loss yesterday. Um, but like me and my team were saying, is like it's just basically a learning experience because every good team that you play is basically a team that um, is better than you, obviously. So that means that only thing you can do from them is learn and that's really all you need to do to get better at the game so we didn't take it too harsh you know we just kind of you know just learned from what they were doing and watched what they were doing and we did lose and we almost beat them second map um but to be completely honest we probably would have lost third map um they were just more experienced team and that's just gonna happen sometimes but it's not that big of a deal because we are two and one right now and if i didn't have basketball today i'm sure we'd be in a lot more today but i do have basketball we might do like maybe two videos game uh, maybe two GBs a day. Sorry, I was reading something on my computer and got sidetracked. Uh, but yeah, guys, I want to know, like, I know for me, like, I have kind of, like, really bad anxiety. And um, if you don't know what anxiety is, it's basically, like, uh, it's hard to explain. But, like, you feel, like, really, really nervous. And um, for me, I get this way when, like, I'm fixing to play a basketball game or something. And, like, I don't know about you guys, but if I ever have, like, a school event or something such as, like, a basketball game... Or like a maybe like a ceremony or something like for NJHS or something, which NJHS is National Junior Honor Society, and that guy kind of got shit on. Sorry, kind of got off topic. Um, but what I was getting at is every time there's something at my school like that, my whole family comes. Like my grandma, my mom, my dad, uh, my stepmom, my stepdad, uh, my my mom's friends. Everybody comes to my basketball games, which might seem like kind of cool, which it kind of is. But for me, I have such bad anxiety, all it does is just bring anxiety on me. And it really sucks, because like if, if you have anxiety, you post in the comments, because you know how bad it sucks. Basically, like your whole stomach just feels like really, um, like you know how people say it feels like your stomach's turning? That's really how it feels, like it feels like really loose. And um, I know for me, like it usually does help me play a little bit better, because you're like, oh shit, I have to freaking impress some people. Oh, I have to do my best. Um, but the other hand, like I really hate it, so sometimes I'm like, can y'all not come? But on, on the other hand, like, if you ever do good, it's like, oh, you're glad that your parents were there. But if you ever do bad, you're like, oh, crap, why did they have to watch this? Um, so it really just depends on how you do, which is kind of bad, but it's, you know, it's, it's true. You always want to impress your parents and make them feel like you do good. Um, but yeah, guys, so if y'all, like, if y'all get anxiety or if you have anxiety, and I even know one of my friends, like, I don't play with him anymore, but he, he, he just goes to my school. And he takes GB a little bit more seriously than I do. And he, like, gets anxiety over a GB match. And that's a little bit too far, in my opinion. Um, GB is a website. It's completely free. Yes, I get upset if we lose. I mean, not upset as in the point I like I'm fucking, like, screaming on the top of my lungs. But, you know, I mean, it's kind of like a disappointment more than, like, a, like a, I don't know what to say. But, like, basketball, like, if you ever lose a basketball game in front of your family and friends, and obviously like I've said in another commentary basketball is not a huge thing in my sport so I don't have to worry about like a whole bunch of my like friends at school coming to watch the games um, but at the football team like the whole school is to watch the game of course not me because I think football is kind of stupid in my opinion and um, I may have said this before but the reason I think football is uh, less exciting than basketball is because anybody can play football you can line two dumbasses up and tell them to hit each other and I'm pretty sure anybody can do that but if you hand some dumbass a ball and tell him to dribble up and down the court and, you know, take a jump shot, chances are he's not going to be able to do that. Um, but, you know, that's kind of on a side shot. And I'm not saying that everyone that plays football is stupid because I know that's, like, what a lot of people think. I'm not saying that at all. I'm just saying um, football guys are douchebags in my school. And that's all I have to say about that. Um, but basketball, I like it because it takes a lot more skill, and it's a lot more exciting. I mean, you're just constantly moving, constantly playing, constantly something going on. And um, that's just more time. Ah, like sloppy shots right there. And that's all right. Um, I try to get this Nate. I'm, yeah, I fail right there. 
Now, we're still trying to figure out like a whole bunch of nades and stuff. And watch this right here. I, I, I think I might have been saying that a little bit too early. But I almost get shit on. Okay. Hold on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. You may not notice what happens at first. But I'll kind of tell you what happens. So basically, I, uh, there's one guy left right. And we already had this round right there. So there's one guy left right there. He tried to knife me through the glass. And I jumped up and shot him. Alright. <laughs> you can see this a little bit better in the kill cam. I don't know if you can hear that because I have the volume turned down, but he tried to knife me, failed knifing me, and then I jumped back and shit on him. That's pretty embarrassing for that guy. Um, I mean, there's a few people that I've, you know, I've got knifed through uh, windows and stuff on my team before in like Mama for two, but there I don't think there was a very good chance he was gonna knife me through that window. Um, but it doesn't matter. That brings you three one. And I, I believe we rushed a little bit too fast right here. Yeah, we rushed a little bit too fast because it was like the last round. And we knew we had defense next round, so we were just like, screw it. And we lose this round. I, I, I did fast forward it because I don't really like watching myself lose. I don't know why. Um, just like when we have film and basketball and stuff. Oh, my God. If I ever do bad, I'm just like, oh, look away. Uh, you know, it's bad enough knowing you did bad in the game. But then when you have to watch it over, you're just like, oh, my God, shoot me. <laughs> but that's just me. I don't know if you guys watch film because I didn't have to like watch film of my games until like ninth grade, which is the grade I'm in now. Like this is the first year we've ever watched film. In middle school, like it was more just like you know go out there and try to have fun, kids. And now it's like you better fucking win, or you know you know it's just a lot more serious now. And I got I went back to the spot and got the guy, the same guy again. It seems like he would have got you to that spot. But like I said, I know this is a little bit campy, but we're still trying to get used to these maps and whatnot. Um, so basically, guys, if you have any stories or if you have anxiety, post it in the comments because I'd love to hear it. Um, anything I have that y'all have, I'd love to hear about. And uh, as always, guys, I love you guys a long time. Thank you for watching my video, and I'm sorry I didn't get one yesterday. Um, but I'll see you guys next time. Bye.